So what's all the hype about Apex Ammunition Tungsten for Waterfowl? Well, a lot of you have been asking questions about it. I've been wondering too, so I got some of it right here. And today we're gonna have a first look at TSS, Tungsten Super Shot, made by Apex Ammunition. Plus, we're also gonna be doing another giveaway. I'm Joel Strickland, and this is Surviving Duck Season. Thanks for watching Surviving Duck Season, where we feed your waterfowl obsession and help you to maximize your hunting experience. Now, ammunition, shotguns, chokes, it's a very common topic in waterfowl world. I see it, uh, questions asked about those things all the time on social media. People DM me and ask questions on my videos about that. Today, I'm gonna be talking about tungsten super shot made by Apex Ammunition. Back before duck season, many of you may remember, I talked about replacing my 870 Remington 12 gauge because it kicks so bad. Uh, I've tried out several different guns over the course of this duck season, 20 gauges and 12 gauges. And one of my favorites is the Winchester SX4 20 gauge. Now I've tried lots of different types of ammunition in the 20 gauge. I've used bismuth, several different brands of bismuth. I've used several different tungsten shots from the different manufacturers. And today I'm really excited to be taking a first look at Apex TSS ammunition. So let's crack open the box and take a look at it right now. When I was talking with Heath from Apex Ammunition, he asked me what type of shot I wanted to use. Well, the smallest shot I've ever used at a duck has been number six. Uh, and I've done quite a bit of that in the past, um, but they make only seven and a half, eights, and nines. So I told him, I said, you know, you tell me what do I need to shoot? He said, well, do you shoot geese? I said, yeah, we shoot a lot of speckle bellies. He said, well, I'll put in some seven and a halves. Uh, that's what we shoot at geese. He said, it'll be a little overkill for the ducks. I'm like, are you kidding me? Uh, but so what we've got is some seven and a halves right here uh, in 1500 feet per second. And it's got three quarters of an ounce of the TSS in it. Now that doesn't sound like a lot. Uh, typically a three inch will have, you know, maybe seven eighths of an ounce or maybe one ounce of shot. But the TSS is way heavier than steel shot, heavier than bismuth. It's even heavier than lead. So three quarters of an ounce is still an awful lot of shot. Um, I've also got, these are number eights. And this, this box of eight actually has one full ounce of the TSS in it. And it shoots 1,550 feet per second. That's smoking fast. I mean, that's every bit as fast as the fastest steel shot. And then I also have, let's see. Yeah, these are the nines, and uh, these nines again are the three quarter ounce uh, loads, and they're 1500 feet per second. Apex Ammunition is made in the USA. They hand pack every single load. I mean, it's a hand loaded deal, uh, which is very interesting to me uh, to find that out. And, you know, why am I trying this stuff out? You know, this, this is arguably the most expensive top of the line ammunition that you're going to shoot at a duck or a goose. Uh, I wanted to find out about the hype. You hear a lot of guys talking about it. You know, there's a lot of guys saying, oh, you don't need all that to shoot, you know, to shoot a duck or a goose or whatever. And that's fine. I mean, you know, but I wanted to see for myself. I have a lot of experience shooting a lot of different types of ammunition. Uh, I've been very pleased with other tungsten ammunition that I've used, bismuth ammunition. I like it. Um, I want to see how this stuff performs because it's a, it's a completely different experience that you get versus the other kind of ammunition because again, it's very, very small shot, gives you a denser pattern. You've got a lot more little pellets that are heavier than the other types of ammunition. So in theory, it should be able to be a lot more effective in knocking the bird down. You don't have it, holes in your pattern, all that kind of stuff because you got more pellets. Uh, I'm really looking forward to uh, to shooting them at ducks and geese. Uh, first thing we're going to do though is we're going to go out and shoot it on some paper, try out a few different chokes, 
try out some different distances and just see what it looks like on paper so I know what's the best selection for me based on where I'm going to be hunting. Okay, so this first shot, I'm using a factory modified choke at 25 yards. This looks great, about 220 pellets inside 30 inches. Now the Apex TSS uh, number nine shot in three quarter ounce load has 275 pellets uh, per round. Now I'm shooting a factory full choke at 25 yards. Well, I pulled the shot a little high. As you can see, it is tighter than the modified. I've got 227 pellets within a 20 inch circle. That's really good. Finally, I'm shooting the same factory full choke at 40 yards. As you can see, it's a bit wider pattern, but still very, very effective. Uh, about 219 pellets inside 30 inches. I could certainly dial this in more with an aftermarket choke, but for my purposes, this setup should be perfect for me. Now that I see what it looks like on paper, I'm ready to see what TSS does on ducks. Let's go hunting. So I'm loading these number nines from Apex. This is Tungsten Super Shot. Let's see what they do on some ducks. Now when I'm guiding hunters, I'm, I don't always shoot. I don't shoot every time I go. Sometimes I, I don't even shoot one time. Uh, but today is a different day. Blow them up. Sit. Andy. Oh my gosh. Are you kidding me? Incredible. This is literally my first experience with the TSS. I shot two times and shot two ducks. Now I know it's easy for me to brag and say, oh, you shot the two ducks, but I mean, you can see my shots right here on the shot cam. Stone these ducks, I mean, wow. Yeah, that, that's very impressive. Oh yeah, shoot him. Andy. Yeah, that, that's just very, very impressive. I mean, there, there's such a difference. I mean, you hit a bird, you knock it down, or you crush a bird. I mean, there's just a big difference in, in what you see there. <laughs> when they bellied up, I went, oh yeah. <laughs> I wasn't sure if you were going to give him one more or not. <laughs> well, I'm going to be honest with you. I'm pretty blown away uh, with the performance of the ammunition. Now, I always hesitate, you know, jumping to conclusions too quick. It's only one hunt. Uh, I've only shot, you know, not even a full box of shells. So, you know, I'm going to continue using the ammunition through the rest of the season. And I'm going to do another video after duck season is over with and kind of give you you know, all the particulars and, and my thoughts on the ammunition as it compares to other things that I've shot. And in the meantime, if you're interested in finding out more information about Apex Ammunition, you can visit their website and I'll leave you a link in the description of this video. Now, if you've been watching a bunch of my videos over the last couple of months, you know that I've been doing lots of giveaways, and we're going to be doing that again today. Now, if you haven't already pre-registered, make sure you go to our website at survivingduckseason.com, and there you can pre-register. And then all you have to do is when you watch these videos and we tell you about it, then just make the comments like we ask you to, and then you're going to be able to be entered into that giveaway. Now, today I'm going to be doing something a little bit different with the giveaway. What I'm going to be doing is I'm going to choose three winners. 
and here's what you're going to get if you win. I'm going to do a personal Zoom meeting with the three of you, and we're going to do kind of a talk for about an hour, an hour and a half, answer some of your questions, talk about ducks, whatever you guys are interested in talking about, that's what we're going to do. Plus, you're going to get a Surviving Duck Season t-shirt as well. So if that's something that you're interested in participating in, let me know in the comments by asking me a question, something that you'd like to talk with me about, something you'd like to learn about on a Zoom meeting with me. Now, if you miss this video right here, it's an awesome hunting video. Make sure you check that one out. Until next time, I'm Joel Strickland. Good hunting and God bless.